Hey there, collectives, and welcome back for another love reading. This reading is going to be for uh, zodiac signs here. We're going to tap into the energy and see how does your person feel about you, what's going on, uh, what is the interference between you and your person, your connection, who is your person. It could be somebody new. So we're tapping into the energy to see... Um, What's going on with you and your person? Let's do it like this, okay? How does your person feel about you, okay? What is your person thinking about you? And what does your person feel about you? Now, we're going to start this reading off with the air sign of Gemini. Excuse me, because I did have a request. Uh, so, if you are a Gemini, tap in. We're going to find out how does your person feel about you at this current time. Uh, is there a secret admirer? Is there someone here that you're in separation with here? So let's see. Keep in mind, Gemini, that this is a general. It's not going to resonate for everybody. So only take the part that fits and discard the rest. Okay? Feel free to reverse the roles as you feel like they need to be. If this energy resonates, Gemini, please like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Thank you so much. And let's see what's going on with your person. So we got the three of wands here. Three of wands. Ace of Cups. See this Queen of Pentacles here. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Three of Cups. Strength could be a Leo. Four of Pentacles. See that Two of Swords. And the Wheel of Fortune. Mm. So, your person. Could be a Leo, could be a Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces with the Three of Cups and Ace of Cups, uh, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn with this Queen of Pentacles and this Four of Pentacles, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius with this Two of Swords and this Wheel of Fortune, Aquarius, Scorpio, Leo, and Taurus. Then you got Leo with the Strength, and you have the Three of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, and Aries. Now you do have the Empress and the High Priestess. They use a lot of these cards coming up in the reverse, by the way, but I'm not going to take reverses because I'm just going to clarify them and I can still get the understanding. So it seems like there's, there's something going on or your person feels like there is something going on. Now, your person may feel like you have a very, very toxic mother figure that's invading your life here or that or, or a child's mother that you're, you're involved with here. You could be dealing, your person could feel like there is a baby mama drama involved with dealing with you or your mother is toxic and she's interfering in your relationship here. It's almost like somebody is holding back here. I'm talking about somebody's really holding back here. Somebody's really trying to resist this connection here. But with this will of fortune here, this is either about divine timing, uh, karma, destiny, fate. A turn of events, something turning around here, a turn of events here. So it could be something that's about to change your person's perception of this relationship or something in your relationship is about to turn around. But someone is clearly holding back, I feel like, um, because of the unknown or because someone uh, does not or somebody's not ready to make up their mind here. It could be somebody's not ready to or somebody is um, denying. That's your energy. Somebody is trying to ignore something. It's almost like somebody's trying to uh, avoid or ignore uh, somebody's love gestures. It could be you dealing with somebody here who wants more out of your relationship. They may want to be committed with you. I just seen the lover's card. That's your energy, Gemini. See, there it is. The lovers. Can you see without seeing? The lovers. Can you see? Wait a minute. I want you to see. See? The lovers. Gemini energy, that's your energy. And then you have, you started off, you got the three of wands here. And right here, you got the three of wands in the reverse. So there is a relationship problem here, choices here, decisions. But it's almost like somebody is waiting here or someone does not see a future here. It could be somebody's not seeing a future here or somebody is tired of waiting here. You got the six of cups here. Somebody, I feel like somebody wants to return or somebody wants you back. So let's see. All right, like I said, underneath the bottom is the lover's card. That's your energy. We know that that has a lot to do with decisions here. Decisions here. Decisions here and um, choices here. Uh, you know, how do you treat your person here? 
you know, what are your goals? What are your intentions? You know, do you have morals? Are you just playing the field? You know, th these are the life lessons here. And see, your energy, Gemini, is the lover's card. So there's always going to be some type of challenge, I, well, I feel like, uh, because there's always going to be some type of choice, a decision. And I feel like your challenge may be in how you respond in your relationships and the choices that you make. So let's see. Now, this is your person's perspective. Respect. This is how your person feels. Why is the three of wands here for a Gemini's person? How do they feel? Three of wands. It's the moon card here. Somebody's not seeing something here. Somebody, somebody may be trying to turn their back, turn their back on something here. But it could be somebody is. It's almost like somebody is waiting on something, but they don't even know what's going on here. Ooh, now you got the King of Wands, King of, King of Wands, and the Queen of Cups and the Queen of Wands. See, I feel like there's two people here. Caught in the middle. You, I feel like you caught in the middle two situations here. See, the king of wands with the, uh, with the queen of wands and the queen of cups. And see, because there's a lot of competition, a lot of arguing going on. Because you may be holding back from some situation. You got the eight of cups and the five. Because I feel like somebody got the. I feel like you got to make up your mind. Is what it is. So you got the moon card. It's almost like somebody does not see something, or somebody feel like something's being hidden from them. So your person feels like you're sneaking. You're keeping secrets here. Somebody feels like there's somebody else here that you're messing with, that you're involved with. Let's see. All right, the three of wands could be a Pisces. Why is the three of wands here? Clarify the three of wands for a Gemini's person. Three of Wands is the Emperor, but the Emperor showing up in the reverse here. Somebody feels like, now, now look, I see this Empress in the reverse here, and the Emperor coming up in the reverse. Somebody could be feeling like you're hiding that you're with your child's mother here. Somebody could be feeling like you're hiding a child here. You're hiding your baby's mother here. See? And they may know it. The Empress and the, the High Priestess, this is secrets here. Like I say, the Empress showing up in the reverse, but I'm not going to take it. But it's almost like somebody, see, somebody feels like you're hiding something. Could be a, a Cancer Scorpio Pisces. They feel like you're hiding a Queen of Wands. Mm. All right, why is the Three of Wands here? Could be an Aries, Pisces. The Fool card. Now, somebody, I feel like somebody does not want to be a fool, okay? I feel like this is what somebody said, see? It could be your person don't see something. And like I feel like somebody's trying to figure out what's going on because somebody may be feeling like you're not invested or maybe you're holding back from them and they may feel like, you know, somebody not seeing something. They want to know. Let's continue. You got the Ace of Cups. And like I said, somebody, somebody may have had a child, okay, with this Ace of Cups. Somebody may have had a child and somebody's trying to make sense of it. Because you got this Queen of Pentacles. Let's see. All right. Ace of Cups. Why is the Ace of Cups here for a Gemini's person? Why is the Ace of Cups here? Ace of Cups. Six of Pentacles. Mm. Now, there's somebody here giving somewhere. Somebody being generous and giving something somewhere else. There go that Two of Swords. See, there's, some, there's somebody here needing to make up their mind. That's what I feel like. And I feel like your person is feeling like, look, you're not investing. You're holding back from me. It must be somebody else. Ace of Cups. You see, I feel like somebody made a baby, y'all. Ace of Cups. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. They go to Hierophant here. Somebody feels like you working on a relationship somewhere. Or maybe this is somebody here who wants you to do it with them. Let's see. Could be a Taurus. But that Queen of Cups want to pop out. There she go. So you got somebody here who is in love with you. Okay. But they feel like they're in competition. See. Now you can have one situation. Somebody feels like you got somebody else. And I feel like whoever this Queen of Cups is, either she wants this relationship with you. Somebody is finding out or that you may have been given somewhere else. Now, I don't know who who in here. There's a lot of energy in here. I know that Empress is in the reverse and that Empress showed up in the reverse. And I see that Ace of Cups. So it could be somebody here who's in love with you. Because this is a twin flame connection here. The King and the Queen of Wands here. 
But then you got the Queen of Pentacles here. So let's see. Now you could be in a relationship with somebody here. And y'all done messed around and conceived the child here. And, but somebody may not be wanting to commit. It's almost like for somebody, you may have went and made a baby, but now, you know, you don't you don't want the person now. And they in love. They they thought that y'all was going to, uh, you know, probably settle down here. Because now you got the Queen of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. It's a lot of energy in here. Spirit, what's up with this Queen of Pentacles for Gemini? Who is this Queen of Cups? Seven of Cups here. Options, illusions, decisions here. See, that's what you're being challenged in. Your options, your decision making here. So this Queen of Pentacles may feel like she is an option here. She feel like you're not taking this relationship serious with this Page of Wands. And now you got the Knight of Cups. Somebody feel like you've been playing on their emotions here. See, they go to Three of Cups again. See, somebody's finding out that they are a third party here. Okay, that's what it is. Somebody's finding out that they're they are a third party here. See? And they feel like you done did them wrong. They feel like you done manipulated them. Somebody feels like you done manipulated them because I feel like there's a third party. Now you got the Three of Cups again. Spirit, what's up? This Three of Cups for uh, the person here. Uh, for whatever. Spirit, what does this person think about Gemini in this Three of Cups energy? Clarify Three of Cups. Three of Cups. Chariot. Moving on here. Uh, try, trying to overcome something here. I feel like somebody's trying to move away from being... I feel like whoever you were messing with, they wanted more, but I feel like you rejected it. You may have re rejected because you may have had too much going on. I feel like whoever Gemini this is, you got a lot going on, okay? That's what I feel like. You may have moved on to something else here. See, somebody say you juggling. Oof. So you got the Three of Cups, the Chariot. Could be dealing with the Cancer, Scorpio, or a Pisces here. Now you got the Four of Cups. So I feel like somebody may be look. See, like I said, y'all, like I said, thank you, Spirit. Somebody, it may not be for everybody, but somebody feel like it was all good at first. But then I feel like it got real because maybe somebody got pregnant or somebody may be saying that you moved on because you rejected the love. You didn't, you wouldn't mean all of that because you ain't got time. See, that's what I feel like it is. I feel like somebody, one of your options, you was, you know, dating may have gotten pregnant, and you may have dipped. <laughs> I just feel like you done dipped on somebody, and I feel like you you got I feel like you got a long list of angry people at you. Now you got the strength card. Could be a Leo. Spirit, what's up with this Leo energy? Why is the strength card here for how Gemini's person feel about them? Clarify strength. Somebody trying to see. Somebody was trying to resist something, but it came down anyway. Somebody was trying to resist the urge. Like I feel like I feel like somebody looking at you like you just a player. Okay, see? See, it's like somebody somebody did too much. It's almost like you somebody somebody luck played. Somebody luck ran out. See? The magician card and the seven of swords. See? All this manipulation that they, they feel, your person feel like you've been doing your luck and play it out. That's why the Wheel of Fortune is here. It's almost like you, I, I'm, I'm, this, this is what I feel like now. And I know this is your person energy, but I'm, I'm the, I'm the mediator. I'm speaking on behalf of your person energy here. I don't have no dog in this race. I ain't picking on nobody. I don't have no problem against nobody, but I have to read the energy like I see it. It's almost like you may have had many options in your life here. And you kept on running from here to there to there to there to there to there. And one of theirs, you may have, you know, may, may, maybe you produced a child here. Uh, but I feel like the person here, let's say if you did produce a child, they thought that y'all was going to settle down. Somebody finding out that they were just an option. And I feel like you was pushing your luck because I feel like sometimes you may have had, I feel like most of these connections may have almost bumped heads. But I feel like you just continue to push your luck as if it wasn't going to happen. And I feel like it did happen. Or it's going to happen. And it's like all of the manipulation. All of whatever you were doing. And your deception is coming to light. And I feel like you're going to start losing some people. Ooh, see. Because you wanted to be that mighty single person here. Now it seems like your luck is about to turn around now. Whatever you. It's, it's almost like. It's like, spirit, it's like spirit is showing me that your luck has turned around. Your luck 
is you you've acquired bad luck now uh everything that worked for you in the past is no longer gonna work for you like i said because now you're the nine of pentacles in the reverse seven of swords the towers like your ways that came out now you got the four of pentacles spirit why is this four of pentacles could be dealing with the taurus virgo or capricorn uh what's going on with uh Gem how does gemini's person feel about gemini in this four of pentacles Four of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, see? Because this is what somebody is looking at you. Somebody was waiting on you, thinking that y'all was going to build something, but somebody realized that they were just an option, and it could and they may have gotten pregnant. That's what I feel like, because they looking at you like you were selfish. You saw that Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. They say you were toxic, you were selfish. You had no intentions on settling down, doing nothing. It was all about you. Somebody fell for it, see? There it is. And there go that empress. I told you somebody got pregnant. See, I told you. And this came up in the reverse, the devil card. But that empress in the upright, somebody got a baby. Somebody got a baby. And they saw, and like I said, because you did this person like that, your luck is going to turn around on you. See, see, Gemini. Does this. <laughs> see there, because of your ways, you wouldn't stop doing something. You don't want to produce a child and you... Did them wrong is what I feel like. Or, or you mishandled a gift. But Spirit say you did the wrong person wrong because now your luck is turning around now. See, it's going to break you down to your knees. That's what Spirit saying. Your luck is changing now. Your luck is changing. <laughs> Look, don't come for me. It could be a Capricorn. could be a Gemini. You see the Wheel of Fortune twice. Now you got the Two of Swords. I feel like, I feel like you... Baddest two of swords is your person is saying you was trying to act like you didn't understand. And you, then you could have blindsided this person. Your person may have didn't even know what they were dealing with with you. Two of swords. Why is the two of swords here? Um, how does a Gemini's person feel about Gemini in this two of swords? We know. Oh, we know how they feel. I feel like this person fell in love with you and they wanted a commitment. See that? Ooh, 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 ooh. Death, you may be dealing with a Scorpio. Ooh, 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 See there? They go to the Ace of Cups. That's that new beginning. That's that baby. See? It's like your luck is going to turn around because you done caused a lot of damage here because of your ego. Spirit say you're being humble, Gemini, because of your ego. Okay? That's what I tell you. Get the Ace of Cups. You turn down some divine love or you produce the child. And Spirit say you you acting like a child when yours is just like rejecting your seed here. And this is why Spirit say your luck is turning around. And now you thought you was all that. Spirit say your, your, your karma is going to bring you to your knees. It's going gonna, it's gonna to humble you out of that King of Wands energy. That's what I see. And they got the Wheel of Fortune. Again, Spirit, why is the Wheel of Fortune here? Uh, how does a Gemini's person feel about Gemini in this Wheel of Fortune, y'all? Seven of Pentacles, seeds that were planted. Somebody thought that they never was going to have to pay this back here. This, this is for all of the things that somebody, somebody has acquired a lot of bad karma here. They've sold seeds of, 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 of distress, see? Because they were selfish. See, there is, again, I'm telling you, spirit talking to somebody. See, that you finna be stripped of something here. See, all because you turned a blind eye and you did not want to change and you didn't want to do the right thing. They go to two of swords again, see? Because you thought you was better than everybody, see? Spirit say you should have married one of these people here. See that? But Spirit said, instead of that, you was going around here breaking hearts. Because I feel like you got somebody pregnant and you this person was in love with you. See? This person was waiting on a commitment here. This person thought y'all was going to do something here out of love here. Somebody may have had a love child by you and they thought y'all was going to get together and they realized that they were dealing with a whole toxic masculine here. But like I say, your luck is turning around here. It's because of the seeds that you... And we all have to go through it. We all have to go through it, see? Spirit says your, your person feel like you finna receive karma, okay? Your person feels like you're about to receive karma for how bad you done did people, okay? Look, I'm just a messenger. If this video resonates, please like, share, and subscribe. <laughs>